experience with sickle cell disease has been a difficult one. Um, diagnosed at birth, most of my life really going through the motions, you know, up and down, mostly downs. Living with sickle cell, it, it gets really hard. There's just pain that lingers all the time. Yeah, I was constantly in and out of the hospital from probably September to April. Just admissions, hospitalizations, ER visits, and there were periods in my life where I, I couldn't even get off the bed. I had given up, basically, and to me there was, I was just existing, and I was actually looking forward to you know, hoping it would end. My support system has been um, my wife. You know, for so long, Amanda had told me, hey, listen, your, your goal in life is just to survive. At this time, Amanda wasn't pregnant, so I feel bad for saying this, but I really did not want to be here. As, as soon as we got the good news that my wife was pregnant, uh, everything, it was literally like a switch. Like my mindset completely changed. I give, gave up on giving up. I, you know, I, was, I had this um, excitement for life that I never had before. Then I started researching gene editing. And then I put a Google alert on uh, for anything that has sickle cell and gene editing in the title, send it to my inbox and Two years later, I got an article in my inbox. I forwarded it to Amanda. We read the article together and we called the, the doctor that same day. Uh, we left the message and the next day he called us back. That, that's how it started. At the time when I was infusing, I was just numb that after all these years, this is you know potentially where it all comes to an end. And uh, yeah, just enjoying looking at the room around me, almost like a, a new birthday, I'd say. Uh, since having gene therapy, the difference is night and day. We, we've had Sebastian and things are going well. We're, we're home and I'm just living life to the fullest, energized, and we wanted to have more kids. So we specifically went and tried for twins. Um, I don't think that I've been able to do that if I had sickle cell. There's no way I would have won that battle. So I felt extremely confident that this gene therapy has really given me an opportunity to live out my dream of being a father, like, you know, let's go get more kids. <laughs> my experience living with sickle cell has definitely affected how I watch my kids grow, I, I let my kids play. I just want them to be happy, you know, um, I'm, we plan on being the parents, or we are that type of parents that whatever our kids want to do, we want them to go out and do it, and our goal is just pave the way to make that happen. My advice to anyone seeking gene therapy is don't be afraid. This could definitely give you the life you're looking for.